<laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, put your hands together for the Clown Prince of Crime, the Harlequin of Hate, the Ace of Knaves, the Joker! Yeah! <laughs> So I just read that someone in Gotham gets stabbed every 52 seconds. Poor guy. What's red and bad for your teeth? A brick. Give a man a match and he'll be warm for a few hours. Set a man on fire and he'll be warm for the rest of his life. Why did Mozart kill all of his chickens? When he asked them who the best composer was, they all replied, Buck, buck, buck. Even the people who are good for nothing have the capacity to bring a smile to your face. For example, when you shove them down a flight of stairs. My friend invited me to his new house. He said to make myself at home. So I threw him out. I hate having guests. I was reading a great book about an immortal dog the other day. It was impossible to put down. The other day, my wife asked me to pass her the lipstick, but I accidentally passed her the glue stick. She still isn't talking to me. Never break someone's heart. Never break someone's heart. They only have one of them. Break someone's bones instead. They have 206 of them. I'll never forget my granddad's last words to me right before he died. Are you still holding the ladder? It turns out that a new study shows that humans eat more bananas than monkeys. It's true. I can't remember the last time I ate a monkey. What's the difference between jelly and jam? You can't jelly a clown into a tiny car. I work with animals, the guy says to his date. Oh, that's so sweet. I love animals, says the date to the man. Where do you work? I'm a butcher, the man says. Why was the leper hockey game cancelled? There was a face-off in the corner. Today, today was a terrible day. My ex got run over by a bus. Just run over. And I lost my job as a bus driver. I don't have a carbon footprint. I just drive everywhere. Sorry, Ivy. It's important to have a good vocabulary. A good vocabulary. If I had known the difference between antidote and anecdote, one of my good friends would still be alive today. What's the last thing to go through a fly's head as it hits a windshield coming at it 70 miles an hour? It's butt. An apple a day keeps the doctor away. It should if you throw it hard enough. Imagine if you walked into a bar, and there was a long line of people waiting to take a swing at you. That's the punchline. I have a fish that can break dance. Yeah. Only for 20 seconds, though, and once. Today, I was feeling nostalgic and decided to go visit my childhood home. I asked the residents if I could come in, but they refused and slammed the door in my face. My parents are the worst. I had a joke about trickle-down economics. But 99% of you won't get it. Why can't orphans play baseball? They don't know where home is. I started crying when my father was cutting onions. Onions was such a good dog. My elderly relatives liked to tease me at weddings, saying, you'll be next. They soon stop, though, once I start doing the same thing to them at funerals. My grandfather says I'm too reliant on technology. So I call him a hypocrite, and I unplugged his life support. My son, who's into astronomy, asked how stars die. Usually from an overdose, I tell him. My girlfriend's dog died, so I tried to cheer her up by getting her an identical one. It just made her more upset, I'll tell you that. She screamed at me, what am I supposed to do with two dead dogs? 
What's yellow and can't swim? A bus full of children. What's the difference between me and cancer? My dad didn't beat cancer. My friend says, if he drives over a cliff, he'll be on his own accord. It's a good thing he drives a Civic. Where exactly are you taking me? The patient said to the doctor. To the morgue, the doctor said. The morgue? But I'm not dead yet, the patient said. And we're not at the morgue yet, the doctor responded. <laughs> if you donate one kidney, then everyone loves you, and you're a total hero. But if you donate five, then suddenly everyone is yelling at you. <laughs> Sheesh. My parents raised me as an only child, which really annoyed my younger brother. <laughs> Did you hear about the Pillsbury Doughboy? He died of a yeast infection. <laughs> Welcome back to Plastic Surgery Anonymous. So many new faces today. I have good news and bad news, the doctor said to the patient. The patient says, all right, all right. Give me the good news first. You only have two days left to live, the doctor says to the patient. Two days left? What's the bad news? It took me two days to reach you, the doctor said. I hate double standards. Burn a body at a crematorium and you're being a respectful friend. But burn a body at home, and you're destroying evidence. My favorite novel is The Hunchback of Notre Dame. I just love a protagonist with a twisted backstory. When ordering food at a restaurant, I ask the waiter how they prepare their chicken. Nothing special, says the waiter. We just tell them they're going to die. A guy walks with a young boy into the woods. The boy turns to the man and says, it's getting really dark. I'm getting scared. The man says to the boy, Well, how do you think I feel? I have to walk back alone. <clears throat> My grief counselor died the other day. He was so good at his job, I don't even care. I'd like to have kids one day. I don't think I could stand them any longer than that, though. Did you hear about the guy who got his left side all chopped off? He's all right now. When does a joke become a dad joke? When he never comes back. Well, Gotham, the pleasure was all yours. Good night, Joker out. I visited a friend at his new house. He told me to make himself it turns out that it. Imagine if you walked into a bar and there was a long line of people waiting to take a punch at you. I messed that up. <laughs> Today, I decided to visit my childhood home. I was feeling nostalgic. Oh, let's see. That's the guy feeling nostalgic. But they refuse to send the door on my face. My elderly. <clears throat> Two hunting buddies are in the woods when one of them collapses. His buddy immediately calls 911. The operator said, I this one up. Did you hear about the Pillsbury Durham? Let's see, I didn't get it quite right. Where do you work? I actually, I got it pretty right. Subscribe for more comedy videos. Now it's time for you, the audience, to comment and vote. What Batman related video should we make? Do you guys want to see Batman complains about work? Spider Bat versus Bat Spider. Ooh. Joker Metal. We are all clowns. Music video. Or Batman visits his parents' graves. The movie. Comment. Vote. Because the concept that gets the most comments will be put into production. Thank you for watching. Joker tells dark jokes. Time for shoutouts. Ralph the Dragon, Emily Arevalo, and Alex Grant. Thank you for your support. Subscribe to Make Laugh Films. Enable all push notifications. Share the video and comment your favorite parts to be eligible for a shout out in the next video.